going on out there? Good morning, Jeff. Good morning, Harry. Good morning, everyone. There is word of arrest this morning in connection with that deadly bombing outside an American hotel in Pakistan. 53 people were killed Saturday when a truck bomb destroyed the Marriott in Islamabad. CBS News correspondent Elizabeth Palmer is in Islamabad this morning. Elizabeth, good morning to you. Good morning, Jeff. Yes, we're hearing reports here that five men have been arrested in connection with the bombing, although there is no word yet on who they are or what their political affiliation is. At the bomb site, local television reports that Pakistani teams have been joined by three American investigators scouring the ruins for evidence. Forensic teams will also be scrutinizing hotel security video that shows the explosive packed truck ramming unsuccessfully the hotel barrier. Minutes tick by until at last the suicide bomber in the cab detonates a small explosion. A brave guard tries to put the fire out, gives up, and then the main blast that destroyed the hotel, killing 53 people, including two U.S. Marines attached to the American Embassy and the Czech ambassador to Pakistan. A third American, a contractor for the State Department, is reported still missing. Things are very tense here still. We can confirm that the three American schools in Pakistan have closed for the rest of the week because they receive what they call a credible threat. And British Airways has suspended flights into here until they can reassess the security situation. Jeff?